um, we will discuss about a data structure which is not linear. Up to now, we discussed several data structures which are linear. That means we uh, go in one, one line, we go forward or backward in one line, like uh, lists, trees, arrays, stacks, and queues. But tree, uh, there's a different, it's hierarchical. That means there's a hierarchy, there's a uh, level. Okay? Uh, each node, we have nodes here, as a level. Okay? So we, um, the, the main, main node is called root. And then we have edges. Uh, so each node has uh, uh, more than one edges. Okay, so uh, so these are the main uh, things, and uh, the other main uh, difference is we don't have no cycles. Okay, so you cannot. Uh, uh, so if you have a cycle, that means you cannot have something like this. So everything should be in the same. Um, this uh, you cannot have something like this. So you cannot have cycles. Okay. So these are the main things uh, in a tree. So we will see how a tree looks like. So tree looks like. So we have a root node, and then we have other nodes, which are derived, descended, we call them, and uh, so we can have something like this, okay. So using this, uh, we can uh, have uh, defined different stuff, so we call this uh, node root. So if we take one node, so so we, we have so this one we call level zero. So the first uh, the main level, and uh, when you go down, you uh, increase the level by one. Level one nodes, level two nodes, and here level three, and there's another level, level four. Okay, so the then. Uh, the nodes uh, so okay. so we have uh, root is the entry node so if you want to enter to a node so we always have to use root and it doesn't have so it's at uh, level zero. So the another uh, example is no. So it doesn't have no parent. So we will uh, uh, discuss about this later. So it doesn't have any parents. Uh, so it's an entry level. And then each node can have each node. And have children, child nodes. So if you have a node, the node directly below this, directly directly below this are called children. So this node has three child nodes okay and then the nodes directly above is called um, is called having parents okay so so if you take this uh, example so this is a child so if we take a 
and B. We can say uh, A, B is a child of A. And if you take a note directly above, so A is the parent of B. Okay, so you can uh, think of that now. So the 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 node directly above, directly above, this one is uh, a node is called parent. So uh, a node can have only one parent. Okay, so node can have many children, as you can see here. So it has one, two, three children, but it can have only one parent. Okay, each node has one parent. So if you take this one, it has one parent. If you take this one, uh, it has one parent. Okay. So similarly, you can check that uh, each node. Uh, that's a property. Each node has only one parent, and it can each node any node can have more than one child, one or zero or one child. Some some nodes like this, uh, it doesn't have any uh, children. Okay. So these are the uh, main property. So you have levels and then we have height. So this is same as level. So the height is the distance from the root. So we come here. So it's one distance. And if you come here, you will have two. The part when you come from root to this one. So this is a height. And then, so this is height. This has a sorry. Uh, it's called a, so we have levels now, and then we will define another uh, the same as levels and depth. So depth is same as Height. So here depth is 0, and the first one depth is 0, here depth is 1. And then we have another uh, definition which is uh, we call height. So height of this node is defined by the, 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 uh, the number of uh, maximum node okay, from here to the last node or the uh, most uh, deep node, the deepest node. Okay. So, so if we take here 1, 2, 3. So the height here of this, so we call it subtree because uh, we can take uh, this as a, and, uh, so if we take this as root okay, of this uh, subtree, so we call this subtree. So this subtree has a height of 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. So, so the height of this subtree is 2, 3. So if we take this one, the height of this subtree, so if we take this one, is 1, height 2 here. So now we will discuss special kind of trees. So it's called binary trees. The binary, binary trees has a special property that each node has a, uh, at most two nodes. So I, the maximum can have two nodes. So you can have something like this or you can have something like this and this one doesn't have anything and you can have an node with no children. So this is these are the only three uh, cases each node can have. So uh, to, uh, to have this uh, so since uh, since we have uh, only two so we can name them uh, so this part is as right and this part as left. So I will use this as uh, uh, 
this standard or this uh, when when I'm discussing trees now. So so how do you uh, now uh, create this structure? So uh, so to create this structure, we can have a structure or node. Okay, so we'll have a structure. Say node. Okay, so here we have to have a node pointer, which is left, and node pointer, which is right. So these are the right child and the, uh, this one, and each node has also have a ID. Okay, so we will say it's an integer here, and we call it key, and you can have some other data if you want, uh, if you need to store. So these are the three essential uh, things each node should have. So we can, you can represent a node using this uh, structure. So we will see now, uh, we can use uh, this to have uh, uh, in our program. So then uh, we have a special, another special kind of tree, we call it binary search tree okay so we, we in this course actually we will be uh, concentration concentration concentrating on binary search trees so there's a special uh, property it's a binary tree so at most two children and then uh, we have a special property, so you have something like this. So we have a key here, say a, a parent, and we have left, and then we have right child. Okay, and each has a key. Okay, so key um, key of left child is less than key of the parent and the other part is key of right child is greater than the key of parent. Okay, so we can use this uh, this property in a binary search tree. Now we will draw a binary search tree with uh, uh, keys. So we will start with root. Say we will put hundred in the root. So then, so we will insert hundred here, and then maybe we will insert fifty five. So fifty five is less than. Uh, the key of root, so the 55 should go here, and then maybe 60. So 60, when you in, always you start with root, so 60 is smaller than 100, so it should be in this side, and so from here, 60 should go here, and maybe 120. So 120 is greater than hundred so it should come here so 40 40 is less than 100 and less than 55 and 115 greater than 100 and less than and 150 greater than 100, uh, 100, greater than 120. So similarly, so if you insert 75, now less than 100, greater than 55, greater than 60, the 75 will come here. So we will add another one, say 130. So 130 greater than 100, greater than 100. Uh, 
120 and less than 150, so 130 will come here. So this is an example of binary search tree, BST.